Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you've been using the Microsoft Edge web browser for a while, you may have noticed this prompt and banner being displayed from time to time called Personalize Your Web Experience, which allows Microsoft to save your browsing activity to personalize Microsoft Edge and other Microsoft services like shopping, search, news, and ads. And obviously, if you click on the Got It tab, uh, that will apply that. And if you don't and you click on Manage Settings, then that will take you over to the browser settings where you can change those settings to your own personal choice and preference. Now, as mentioned, this prompt and banner does display from time to time. Um, in the browser and if you do find this intrusive or distracting or annoying or maybe just concerned about your privacy then just a quick video to show you how you can actually disable this personalize your web experience prompt or any other similar banner in the stable version of Microsoft Edge in case you're unaware. Now it's not a setting we can head over to and turn off in the browser. This is a default feature so to disable and turn off uh, this uh, prompt and banner we have to disable an experimental flag and to get to the experimental flags page as many of you may know by now we head to the address bar and we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags and in the search just type in and enter this flag called edge show feature recommendations and i have found though if you just enter recommendations that will also be enough to bring up the relevant flag which is called show feature and workflow recommendations and the description reads as when this setting is enabled microsoft edge may show active messages recommending specific features and workflows based on your activities which as mentioned this personalize your web experience is a very similar prompt and message or any other similar message so as you can see it's a default feature so the flag is set to default so to turn off and disable this this um, feature we actually have to disable that flag as mentioned so we click on disabled and then we'll have to restart microsoft edge version 114 which is the current stable release and now you'll notice in the browser obviously and that if you are using the browser you will see less a lot less if not all of these prompts personalize your web experience uh, being disabled and turned off or any similar banner in the browser as mentioned so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one